RC family here. Getting ready to break down this reds. Bust it down. This reds 521 engine. Just getting ready to look at the insides and see what it's working with. You know how we do. Just see what's going on in the inside. So yeah, awesome engine. Like I said, a good budget quality engine. Can't beat it. Great for the beginner. Just got the basic two needle carb. Basic two needle carb carburetor. Just a high end needle and low end needle. No three speed. But don't be scared of that three speed needle. So just getting ready to break it down. See what it's working with, see what it's working with. And um go from there. Alright, here we go. I'm using the reds tools. Get y'all a pair of these. Awesome. Good quality tools. So here we go. So yeah, man, just um just awesome man to be able to to be able to do this. Get the like I said in my other video, most popular tools that you're gonna need, or I'm gonna need is that 2.0 millimeter and the 2.5, which is the is highlighted in orange. Highlighted in the orange, the 2.0 highlighted in blue. Get you some of these reds tools, good quality tools, all this aluminum, good tips. So here we go. So yeah, just um, uh, it's a good awesome motor, a good basic motor to, to start with. It just this is just a good motor. It ain't gotta be. It's not just cause it's 521 sport. Do not mean that it's less quality, or it won't get you through a. A major event like a race time event. I've seen plenty of these. Plenty of these do very well at like a race time event, something like that. So, so yeah, don't be afraid to to um. Get, get 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 this quality budget friendly and good quality so yeah I'm just here at my mom's house she had to do some stuff with the with the church this weekend so I'm here staying with grandma doing my duty you know family come first so but yeah y'all need to catch them nationals that's on YouTube right now all of the head no CG look at that quality quality look at that head button milled out be lighting quality we're gonna leave them screws in the lever then so it'll be easy to put back together So yeah, when you break down your engine, take note of the three dots in the back. That's 
exactly how it come off this is exactly how, this is exactly how it's going to go back on so pop his head button off time with it new no. so take your time with it don't want to mar nothing up great great compression you can hear it there it goes got three three shims as you can see Leave that there. Good quality. See the sleeve already came out. Let you know that is fresh. There you go. Sleeve. Exhaust port. As you can see. Fire port. Exhaust port. One, two, three, four, five. Look at that quality. Nice cuts. No burrs. Great, great quality. Told you this great quality budget engine. Put on the light. No burrs at all. Look at that. Five port. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Good. Get the two millimeter. I'm gonna take out the back plate. We're gonna roll. Roll that piston up to the top. We don't want to catch on the skirt. One thing about this, I just, just wish they had a little bit more oil on it. Just to help lubricate. Help lubricate the um, the internals a little bit, a little more. The only thing I see. Let's take y'all some of these tools. Reds tools, y'all see how easy this is. I just like putting everything back in the hole so when I get ready to put it back, it'll be easy to get the sleeve up. Get the screw out of the back of that. I'm just gonna twist this back plate. Get the offset in a little bit so we can put it on now. There you go. Quality. Quality. Got the red emblem. Look at this. Quality. Just wish I had a little bit more oil, but it is oiled up. Wish I had a little more, but it's sufficient. It's sufficient. As you can see down in the, in the case. I'm trying to see. 
down in the case you can see a sport engine but it got two slugs in there I'm gonna take this take this take this carburetor off Fold on the side for your car. Quality car. more of the aluminum car you can see inside it's good aluminum cars do very doable very doable durable very dur durable it's a short needle short needle y'all can see that it's a short needle car. Carb screw, low end needle. That just mean that it'll be um just easy to tune. Easy to tune. Just take your time with it. Short needle, low end needle. You can see. Y'all can see that. But yeah, quality. Quality reds. Quality. Quality. Okay. Get this piston out. Gravity to your advantage. Shake it right.
good thing because this does have the oil on it. That's why it's so hard for me to get a grip on it to get it off the, the crank pin. this fit tight fit Hold on, just one second. Hold on. And pause it. Off the pin. Here it go. Just like that. Just like that. They knew. So that, like I said, this new this engine is not broken in. It's the piston. Engine's not broken in at all. Brand new. So everything's very tight fit good so you got the your oil your oil return hole from the off the piston on the back of the piston when you get ready to install it make sure it's good because this reminds you make sure the red logo that's on the that's engraved here on the piston is pointed towards you towards the back of the engine like this you get ready to put it back in so yeah, here's the piston. It's your standard .21 piston. Rod, Ray, it's rod. Push the crank out. Look at this. This is a sport now. A sport. Look at that. The crank is filled on a sport engine. That's what I'm saying, this is quality. You got a field crank on a sport engine, budget engine. And you got slugs on the crank, brass slugs on the crank for balancing. Quality budget engine. And then, like I said, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna show y'all another video where you can put a DLC coated crank in here. I got another video coming. You can do a DLC coated back plate. That's coming. So when this wears out, look at this quality parts, quality, quality parts, case. This is not ceramic bearings, but you can replace these steel bearings with ceramic bearings. Steel front, front bearing. Also a steel rear bearing that comes in here stock. But you can re replace these with ceramic front and front and rear bearings. Look at that. Clean, clean, clean. 
Look at that. Clean. So yeah. Ain't nothing sport about this but the name. This is quality. Quality, 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 quality. Like I said, when it's when it runs out, wears out, I'ma um do a DLC coat of crank, probably do ceramic bearings, do a DLC coated back plate, and let it rip, let it rip. In this case, this case will hold a, um, a seven port sleeve. This case will hold a seven port sleeve. So if you want to make this to a seven port, you very well could from this five port. But I'm gonna let stay a five because I might want to put it in my truck. A little bit more bottom end on the five port. But the red seven ports, plenty bottom for your truggy or whatever you want to put it in. Plenty power for whatever. Big track, definitely on the truck, you may want to, you know, put that seven port in there on a bigger track. But hey, it's all about how you tune your engine with the what pipe you run. Probably with this. To say if I may have been on a bigger track, I may run that on um, Red's um, 2113 pipe. A little more top end pipe, even though this is more of a bottom end engine. Um, to pull it more top end speed, I might go with the uh, that 2113 pipe, maybe with a 14 bell. Just give me more top end with this. But this definitely will pull 14 tooth clutch bell, 15 tooth. This definitely will pull it with no problem. So, there's another thing to think about. So, hey, look for a good quality budget engine, five port parts that you can replace. An easy carb to tune, two needle carb, top end needle, and your low end needle. Hey. Jump on this 521. Come with your collet for your flywheel for your clutch collet. Comes with it automatically on the crank. Again, if you need parts for it, strictly for the 521, it does come with this exploited parts list that you can order some parts from Reds Racing USA. It comes with this, all these parts right here. Even got the car breakdown. Exploited view, all your parts here. So yeah, this EKJ twenty four thousand here. Just want to break down, bust it down. Five reds, five twenty one sport engine. Ain't nothing sport about it. It's all, all good quality, budget friendly engine. A quality budget, budget friendly, not just cheap engine, but quality budget. That's a difference. So yeah, this EKJ24000, just getting ready to put it right back, back together. So we're just gonna do the crank, put the crank back in. Look at that. This is quality, look at this, slug. Epoxy feel crank. These are standard bearings, not 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 um ceramic. She don't really need them right now. We do have them on the site. Put the sleeve, piston back in. This piston back in logo pointed towards the back of the engine. The 
rock it a little bit. Time, don't force it. No need, ain't none. Well, ain't none, not in a rush. New, I said the fitting is gonna be tight. Fitting is gonna be tight, so don't force it. Back on. Sleeve here. Just make sure that notch is with the notch to the back. Make sure that notch is on the, the pin in the back of the engine. Just take your time. And move the sleeve up a little bit. So it'll slide down. the piston up Make sure that crank is pushed all the way in. It will help you with lining the sleeve up with the, the piston with the sleeve. Just trying to make sure it's lined up.
time. Everything is straight. Just like that. Make sure everything lined up straight. straight lined up take your time don't 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 rush take your time everything will line up like it's supposed to now it's time to put the head button back on three dots towards the towards the back of the engine like that Bottom dead center. Head on there. That's why they leave the screws in there so you automatically line up. Just like that. Now I got them in. So now I like to put a little lock tight. Y'all hold on one second. <clears throat> okay, I'm back. So I got the the hose lined it lined so now I'm gonna use my 2.5 millimeter what I'm gonna do is I'm so yeah family got everything back together like I said if you're looking for a great quality budget engine Y'all seen the insides and out. And I gave y'all some option parts that you can work, can use with this engine to make it even that much better. Like I said, I'm gonna use it. I'm gonna make it into my um, 521 Beast Mode engine. Just like I said, you can re replace the crank for a DLC coated crank. You can redo the bearings with ceramic bearings. Um, replace the back plate for a DLC coated back plate and spinning back plate has been sold from Reds Racing as a upgrade performance part. Y'all gonna see that soon in the video. The spinning back plate. Um, but yeah, a great budget quality engine that's gonna last you, and you can race it or bash with this with this plenty of power at any race at any bash session like I said this is a good learning carburetor to, to learn how to tune two new carb high end and low end no mid speed needle just that chrome finish right here on that side where a mid speed needle would be saying just the idle screw right there so hey EKJ bringing y'all the fresh hot new 
great quality products, reviews, product showcases that we can use, man, and um, have a great race season, have a great bash season, and all the parts are replaceable. EKJ 24,000. Hey, treat people the way, treat people better than you want to be treated. How about that? For 2023. There's no haters be motivators. Action speak loud on words. Get out. Rip something. It's pretty. It's summertime. There's no excuses now. Rip something. If you ain't ripping, you're tripping. Left tie salute. EKJ. Get your reds too. Ooh. Ooh. I'm out.